Boys, how you been? Glad we could spend the day together. I think you're going to like this one. Got a little bit of a plan today. It involves the the Yoda. Not sure if we'll be able to get it to the to the old rusty H today or not, but we got the hood up on it too. But I took the uh, the brake McSigurder off there, and if you line her up so the holes you can see the holes, you can sound this. No quite, no quite, right? So, ah, uh, we gotta get the drill out. So, you know, we could just like widen those holes, but that's not uh, very copacetic. So I think we'll uh, attempt to mark and drill the proper bolt location and plus Makuta out the center, get it as best best we can and then uh, we look at Santos over here we got these fanny pant center and uh, lub nups there and I like the washner I like that it's just this part too deep so if we I got the lathe set up there so we just got to chowder off the end there I'm gonna put a friggin uh, a chanthier bit in there so we can just run that into the into the end when we cut cut the end off clean up the threads a little bit and then uh, yeah we'll still be able to use them for the original rims it's just not going to go in as deep probably but uh, yeah you can set like the size of the opening oh that's a bigger much a bigger one but uh, yeah so hopefully it'll fit six inch and five and a half inch stove pipes but we got to open the middle up to at least four inch. It's got smaller middle and bigger, bigger uh, bolt spacing. So, any words? Got 24 lug nuts to modify and 24 holes to drill and four centers to wallow out. Good times. Well, now that it's going to totally rain, we'll uh, go outside and <laughs> clean up the rims. Pardonski. Just under attack, terrible. Mosquito, no go. Well, good thing one of us was paying attention. Friggin, uh, that's not gonna work anywhere. The, uh, the rims sit flat, and uh, that that no sit flat, that's, you got a bunch of stuff in the words there, so. Frig sakes, we're gonna have to, uh, I don't know, rig up some sort of a wheel space near really only need two for the fronts just to get it past the uh, the Earth's Colio friggin inch and a half or so I got some pretty sure they're five five lug for Dodge but uh, I'll go have a look see if I can't find them maybe we can just ruin them to uh, to fit the application beg my pardon well the one good thing about getting wheel spaceners is uh, we won't have to open up the middles we can just leave those, so we'll just have to drill up the holes in accordance and uh, hopefully find some spacers. We can put the backs on, I think. I'm pretty sure. But not even really, because we'll have to open up the middle. But yeah, so I guess the uh, plan's already decked, boys, but we can still drill up the holes. Figure, just try the friggin' uh, mag drill, but I don't know if there's enough surfoos. There's enough bit of the surface. It's got quite a bit of paint on it too, so we'll see. If it tears my arm off, we'll have to hand drill them, I suppose. This black one is named Dodge. Hmm. Oh, you missed it. There's this dick here, and we were saying some stuff, and then he left and did a big burnout. It was awesome. 
I was looking for my camera, I was sitting on the bumper right by the key. Don't let me forget that's where the key is. But we drug these inside. You know, I didn't want to get the dust all chooching in the shop. We have the option of the outdoor region, right? But uh, yeah, I don't know. I found some wheel spacers. I might have to go and pick them up. Blah, blah, blah. But we'll get these marked out and everything in the meantime. And uh, yeah, hopefully, hopefully that uh, works. And then we shouldn't have to uh, move for coot or lug nuts at all but for 30 bucks I can get uh, get some different lug nuts all together so I think that's what I might do oh I got the old uh, center punch center punch Uxion. yeah oh I'm excited boys the dick with the spacers messing me back says he'd take a friggin deal excuse me but it's how much or something. Plus he's at work, so he's gonna call me when he's uh home from work with some nonsense. Egg soup, how much or something you'll come. A whole paddy wax over there in some sort of hooks of dazzard mobile for freak's sakes. And I gotta oh man, I bet you that thing lights terrible. Yeah. What were we doing? Oh yeah, I got the mag drill going. We're gonna twist our arms off, but I'm I'm the camera guy. Oh, <laughs> hey, so I don't know. It's not quite, you know, because it's like a pressed thing, right? So it's not totally flat. So it's a little bit of wobble onto it. So I don't know how good the magnet's gonna stick. And uh, yeah, but we're gonna give her a whirl. The mosquitoes get you terrible. It's great. It's great, I'll get the tripod. I lost this, eh, because I shrunk it down. It was sitting right here this morning. Tripod, right there, right? Looked fucking everywhere. I, I even went around the yard because I thought, well, maybe. What happened? Well, not hours, I mean, maybe 25 minutes until it started raining, right? Like I wandered around, it was nice. It was about this sunny out, and then I was going to do some stuff, and then I had to bring it all inside because it started just pissing. Terrible, now it's sunny out again. Weatherman no go, but uh, anyway, it's they're all marked out with the semi centers. So, hopefully, with uh, any lux, we can just punch these holes in there and nobody gets totally twisted up like a pretzel real bad. But I'll get it on a movie big time if they do. <gasps> Hard drive filled up. Pug one no go. Missed shot. Uh -oh. Put wheel on. Lighter up! Got this one on though. Fits friggin' perfect. Yeah, it friggin' does. Holy. Just below grin. RT even. Oh, there's the Kijiji dick right there. Maroon Dobbs. Oh, I best get my tape measure out. Make sure he's not fucking around. How you doing? Good, you? Not too bad. Safety enthusiast? No, I just got no work. Oh, I apologize. <laughs> Perfect. Awesome. Okay. Thanks Thank you, sir. Yes, sir. Okay, have a good one. Right on. See ya. Appreciate it. Score station. Right, we will. I think that's what this guy. 
guy's doing too. Yeah. Yep. He's Just backed right up to her. He's gonna fucking haul her off. Wanna help him or quit? Yeah, we can help him. Alright. Just re-rig it? Your, the branches are getting in the back of your truck. You want to just reattach it? Okay, just back up a little bit. Uh, yeah, you have to. Just unhook it here. Okay, whoa! Okay, whoa! Just get her right around that fucking crotch there. Yeah. tree <laughs> oh, good lord <laughs> broke the stop sign down too that's not good Probably good enough. At least one lane's open. Fuck it. We did good work. We drilled the holes the, the wrong size the first time, but we got uh, we got the stove pipes to fit. And I'll have to show this you 
But the only thing is, the I was able to scrounge up some lub nuts. Wrong ones. I only have one of this variety. Probably throw 20 dozen of them away. But that guy there, I'll screw into there. And then allowance of the flush flush fit stove pipe. And then, uh, yeah, but these ones, no room for a sakut. You know, maybe. Maybe, we'll try it. But I got uh, a few of those guys. But, yeah, I'll just get uh, those on Mundards, I guess. But uh, that son of a bitch will fit on there now. I'll do a little bit more dicking around, but the mosquitoes out here are just relentless. Need to pour more oil in the driveway. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, does that thing light? <gasps> are you picking? Yeah. You love picking. I love to dream. Look at your picker. <gasps> That's disgusting, Tipple. <gasps> <laughs> Wonders, eh? We got some plans. We got a week, so sooner or later, we'll get enough dicking around together. But yeah, as soon as we got them ones, sure as shit, found ones that are actually from a Tacoma. Those ones are off of Nada, so the lugs are, are bigger. That's why we're having issues. Good group. But oh, we're heroes, buddy. We did it. Terrible. We saved a baby drowning in the river. Yeah. <gasps> You guys are like rescue rangers. Yeah, terrible. Oh, but that was so great. We did it. But it was not great at the same time because we got sopping. Hey, for frig's sakes. Should almost like chisel a Marmaduke out this corner. <gasps> Light her up! <laughs> I wasn't expecting that. <laughs> oh, I gotta go. Just getting under tacked. Holy. Everybody knows you're an inwood now. <laughs> oh my goodness. All right, well. Yeah, must be pug wine. We'll, uh,. Get a smaller, uh, smaller socket. Uh, get a, just a regular socket, maybe. See if that works. I'm so freaking excited! Yeah, it's gonna be awesome. Yeah. It's gonna be freaking awesome. I don't know. I don't know what's happening. This usually doesn't uh, work out this way, but full crank, no rub. I mean, these things, these couldn't fit more better. Hey, look at this. Full crank, no rub. These things couldn't fit more better. These peeny, even up in there. Everywhere's everywhere. Just to the fit of the perfect on boys. D friggin' scent. Yeah, man, we'll have to get uh, some flat washner uh, lug nuts for there. And we'll have to find 12 more. 12 by 1.5 lug nuts of the smaller short stump variety for the uh, the back we got two options we could go with either one of those right there either one of those will work for the for the uh, inner to hold the hub itself to the truck and then uh, we'll have to get more of a type of uh, something like this with like a washner on it obviously that's way bigger than uh, what we're calling for, but uh, yeah, with the washner on the bottom would be ideal, but even uh, just just a regular old flat back nut will work. 14 by 1.5, surely I got something. Mm -hmm. Look at all this shit. Well boys, a couple things hindered us today in the process. First was uh, we drilled half inch holes for the extra, you know, for the holes that we needed and they're just perfectly drilled, perfect, perfect. But if we drilled them 5 8 5 8 snapped it, it would have been even more perfect because I didn't realize that the spacers that we were going to pick up, 14, 1.5. On the truck, 12, 1.5. So, uh, uh, we got, we're going to save those lug nuts for the original rims just in case, you know, we end up whatever, getting another truck. 
putting those back to stock for selling these purposes because you know decent I got 40 pounds in them right now but uh, yeah that son bitch mounted on there I mean I'm gonna get different lug nuts obviously and I'm gonna clean up the rims a little better and stuff like that but it is you know we could like put it in 59th gear uh, and uh, and driver for test but yeah I mean it, it it fits this and that the only thing I've only got uh, two lub nups that fit that's it so I went through my hoard that's all the lug nuts I can find right now I had a bucket of them in the shed but they're they got the threads on them to like hold a thing so they're like longer so they protrude into the area the, the back of the rim is gonna hit so yeah some of them are too big these ones appear to be the right size, but they must be like half, you know, 13 or something threads. Not, uh, yeah, I don't know. I don't know what I'm talking about. But, yeah, just all different ones. I think that one will fit too. But it would be better if we had flat back washeners to hold the rims on. Or flat back lug nuts. So we're gonna we're gonna get those the parts deck, eh? Gotta you know, closed on sundards and different things. So we'll uh, hopefully get those mundards and then be able to button that all up there. Friggin' rights, decipini, all that kind. It's my dirty squizzit. My dirty one. But uh, yeah, that's probably that's probably her. I'm, I'm hoping we can get a couple good days of the weather so that we can uh, do some painting on her. Let me know what color you think we should paint the mud truck, boys. Hey, if we paint your, if we paint it the color you pick, you come for ride along. And you come for ride along at Melbourne, my madness. But uh, anyways, boys, less than a week now. Hey, less than a friggin' week. We got uh, yes, frig Steve come down to work on the friggin' on the mud chops, and it rained, and we just went for a drive to get spacers. Drilled a couple rims, had a cheech. <gasps> but next weekend will be pretty fun, I think. So, uh, freaking right, it's looking forward to that. Get away from the old homestead for a minute. Freaking, uh, forget about the 80 tree. Hey, eh? get my mind off the 80 tree for a few minutes. But, uh, anyways, boys, let me know what you think. I really, uh, I mean, for what we're doing, it couldn't really be going any more smoother because, uh, we could have just not found wheel spaceners. We could have, yeah, got wrong ones, eh, because that's pretty easy to do on Kijiji. But, uh, yeah, I mean, I don't think it's going to hurt, eh? Those tires aren't going to hurt in the mud, that's for sure. But, uh, yeah, let me know what you think. I'd really appreciate you on the figure fudge again on that like button. we got the Patreomics, eh? The Patreomics there, if you wouldn't be much of blurgers than to partake in into that accord. we got the Sunday Fun Day and the Early Vitches and the friggin' Gritty Gritty and uh, different things, plus uh, Piss Off the Goof, and that's the best part. Any words, boys, for again a uh, couple of itches from in the week. So, uh, words, there you go, another dick of home and Until tomorrow. Thought the launchers get you.